bounces out for a touchback. And the Ohio State offense will feature these men on the attack now as they come to the ball. Their quarterback, he must have a consistent game today. The fullback, Barry Walker, good speed and power. And there he is, the nation's premier running back. 21 touchdowns. Lanise outside, smart and sure-handed. And then the great freshman receiver, Chris. Now that offensive line, Rory Graves improving. The next man right there, Jim Lachey, a first-rounder in the eyes of many scouts. Mags are starting for the injured louder mill. Zelensky, very strong. And another all-star performer is Karowitz out of Toledo, Ohio. Tom Zach, the senior from Calumet City. Checking the defense. Pitch to Byers. Has the corner. First down. Run out at the 49-yard line, and Brad Tucker, number 30, the defensive corner man, got over on third down again early in this game. And this is a tough down, three, about three and a half yards to go for. Tough call to runner pass. He puts Lanise outside with Carter, and Lanise comes in motion behind Tomza. They'll throw it off the fake to Byers. Byers goes out of the pattern. He's picked up. Now they throw it to him. And he gets the first down and inside the 45. Beautiful run. I don't know why the defender got off it. Woolridge has checked in at tailback. Second down for Tom Zach and the Bucks. Woolridge goes out. They throw deep to Lanise for the first down inside the 35-yard line, down to about the 33. Beautiful. On a bit of a reverse action. They counter with him, but they come out with the eye formation here. The pitch to Woolridge. First down. Gets inside the 20. Mallory finally back on the tack. Fatty Star back on the field. Byers has checked back in at tailback, number 41. He's set behind Walker, the fullback. Second and eight. Tom's act to put it up. Beautiful catch by Lanise at the six yard line. They'll spot it down at the five yard line. Cochran was all over him, and Tom Zack drilled it in that time. Look like a might. The touted freshman here at Ohio State. Here is Byers. Squeezed through for a couple of yards. Did you see? See if they go to that play down here on third and goal, or elect to run something else. Here he comes. He got into the end zone. Touchdown, Ohio State. He was across the goal line by the time he fumbled the ball. He had the touchdown, and the Buckeyes strike first. This is something that Michigan must be concerned about. If they fall behind by a couple of touchdowns, this could be a long afternoon. Bo Schembechler does not have firepower on offense like he has had in the last decade and a half. It is 7-0. Spangler has added the extra point. Here we take another look at this was well blocked. There's a big hole. This time he doesn't have to work quite as hard to get this ball in the end zone. Watch the hole right there. Beautiful for oh, and you can see the ball was stripped, but he was past the goal line, and it didn't make any difference whether he got it or not in there. And we'll be back right after this message. That time, he took the blocker away, and then Kalik got the job done. This could be a passing situation. Intercepted in the end zone by Sonny Gordon, number seven. Zerbrook trying to force the ball that time. Two tight ends for Michigan. And Zerbrook's going to put it up. And he will not get it off. The Buckeyes were not fooled. Chris Silius, number 97, led the defense. And the Wolverines will be forced to punt. Brent, that was a mistake. Robbins standing on the Michigan 29 yard line. Ten men on the line for the Buckeyes, but they drop off. Lanish at the 12, hit right there. Loose ball, fumble. Michigan's ball, 18 seconds, and the clock is stopped at 17, and an enormous break, and there we go. 
imagine the whole state of Iowa is watching right now, too, because if the Wolverines can come back, the Hawkeyes can get to Pasadena if they beat Minnesota tonight. Morris is out, stopped short of the 10-yard line. The Buckeyes were all over that punt. There's Chris Spielman, number 36, another member of this outstanding freshman class. What a future he's got as a linebacker here. Winston, here's Bergeron. This, of course, the 45-yard attempt. He is one for one here this afternoon. Long enough, and it's good. Bergeron has just pulled Michigan to within one point. It's 7-6, 7 7.55 in the third. Here is Bergeron, a young man who is not under scholarship right now in Michigan. Bo explaining that situation to us there. He got him a good job in the offseason. He was a night watchman, and of course he's due to graduate around Christmas. And so he's been paying his own way to Michigan, and right now he could be the most valuable man in that school. No good. He misses. Ohio State holds on to its one-point lead. Eckler's defensive coordinator, Gary Moeller, the former head coach at Illinois, has done a marvelous job here this afternoon. He's matched against the former assistant he had at Illinois, and that, of course, is Mason, the offensive coordinator of the Buckeyes. Beautiful. Oh, Lenise grabbed the ball at the 40-yard line. Mike Lenise with a sensational catch for the bucket. Second and eight for Tom Zach and the Buckeyes. They throw it again. He wants Carter. He's got him for a first down and out of bounds at the 25, 31 yards. Now Carter goes in motion. They'll run by it. Into the wall, he comes free, and on the second effort, he's inside of the 15. And that catch of Lanise just gave the Buckeyes a tremendous. Got to go to either Carter or Lanise on this play. Sends Byers out over the middle, and he's got big Keith Byers down at the two-yard line. On the option this year, but here today it's too important. Here it is now, third and short, and there's Byers dives into the end zone. Touchdown, Ohio State, and they're moving close to the Rose Bowl. Send Mark Ray in motion, and White will go across the field and take him. Zerbrug rolls with time, hits his tight end Nelson. First down, fumble, Ohio State's ball. William White picks up the bouncing football. Close from this vantage point. Now the Bucks will try to run that clock down at 5.58. Byers with a huge hole in the middle. Cuts over to the right, inside the 25, 20 and out of bounds. In California, here we come. Here's Woolridge, who's replaced Byers, breaks up the middle inside the five-yard line. And the Buckeyes are going to get one more, it looks like. Real, what kind of an afternoon he'll have against the likes of Keith Byers, who just has scored his third touchdown. And you can start the engines, folks. Here come the Buckeyes to California. Celebration is underway in Columbus. The Buckeyes are going to the Rose Bowl. 